this is the entryway from the front door. Take two steps in and you're already in the kitchen. This is my Kratom corner. You can see I've got plenty of bottles of Kratom, jars of Kratom and sugar and stevia and my tools to make Kratom, lemon juice and my milk stir. An empty sink which is unusual. And we walk into my living quarters, which is nice. This is my studio for which I use to edit my videos. And this is my editing station with that as the computer and that as the monitor. And sometimes I use that as a monitor too. And you got the Buddha, the Buddha. And then back here, this is where I film everything on the green screen, which is why I have such pretty backgrounds. So that's my apartment. Hope you enjoyed that. Hey everybody, so much for the studio tour. Um, anyway, today I wanted to talk to you about Kratom for depression. Because I personally suffer really, really bad depression. I've been diagnosed with clinical depression since 2003, since I had the stroke. And what that means is my brain doesn't produce enough serotonin. So antidepressants are serotonin reuptake inhibitors. So what they do is the serotonin that your brain does release, it kind of holds it in a little synaptic cleft in your brain and lets it build up and build up and build up and then it sucks it in. That's the very simple way to explain it. So what Kratom does is it releases dopamine. Just like cocaine, just like marijuana, it releases dopamine, which is another feel-good neurotransmitter. Therefore, with all the dopamine being released, I don't really feel the need to have a SSRI in my life anymore, so I stop taking my my antidepressants. I don't recommend anybody else stop taking your antidepressant until you talk to your doctor first, of course. I tend to do what I want medically, so I wanted to get off of them. I found a way to do it, and I did it. And I am about ready to fall asleep right now for some reason, but I have been very happy since I started drinking Kratom and I've not needed antidepressants anymore. In fact, I don't even take my anti-anxiety medication anymore. My neighbor needed some so I gave her my whole bottle because I don't use them anymore and it's probably bad that I gave somebody else my bottle of anti-anxiety anti medication because it is a controlled substance and she could be a junkie. I have no idea. But anyway, this video was about can Kratom be uh, an alternative to antidepressants and in my opinion I think it can be as long as you talk to your doctor first and test it out slowly I mean don't just go to cold turkey off your antidepressant it might throw you into a major depressive episode but slowly chip away at your antidepressant you know take a little chip off of it while still t keeping the bulk of it in your diet and find the right strain kratom for you that will aid with releasing dopamine in your brain because dopamine is a feel-good neurotransmitter and we all need it to feel good and so I feel good most of the time oh that's hot so anyway y'all in conclusion kratom can be used for depression it might even work alongside your antidepressant take it with it and see how you feel you might bump up to the next level of happiness you might actually be so happy you want to go make friends and get out of your house and live a normal life which is something that hardly any of us do when we're depressed we don't really live a normal life so anyway y'all i hope you're having a very good weekend and i will talk to you later Bye bye